Femi, you've yep. got years, decades, potentially even experience in working with both in-house and agency digital yep. marketing teams. In your experience, what are the differences between the two? The number one reason why someone, a marketing leader like yourself, would consider hiring an agency is because you believe that agencies have better skill capabilities than in-house teams. That is not 100% true. In some instances, it's applicable. Agencies work with multiple clients. They have a broad range of experience across different industries. So they bring that to the table. The same thing with marketing consultants like myself. We've worked with multiple types of organizations so we can bring those expertise and those experience and apply it. We know what works. Whereas in an in-house team, you can also have that level of skill, but it's only then limited to just one industry or one website. But again, you can hire someone in-house that has, that has an agency background that will also bring the same level of skill. So it's, you don't have to hire an agency to get that breadth of skills. Also, you can hire a marketing consultant. So that, that is from a skill perspective. The number two thing is from a, a cost perspective. So there's this idea that if you build an in-house team, it is more expensive. Or if you hire an agency, it's more expensive. The cost is subjective, depending on your marketing budget and depending on the skill capabilities you have. The problem why people hire agencies is because they can't find the right skills in-house. But I beg to differ that if you really, really are looking to save cost, you can hire someone with an agency background and bring them in-house. Because if you look at the costs of agencies, it's quite expensive. I'll give you an example. If you're a marketing team that spends like a million pounds on paid advertising, 15 to 20% of that will go to agency fees. Whereas you can use that money to hire someone full time. So I don't necessarily agree that it's more cost effective to hire an agency. I actually think it's more cost effective to hire an in-house team that will save you money and you have more control. And then agencies have multiple clients, so it's difficult for them in terms of, although they give you the skill capability, but when it comes to context switching, you have a particular person managing your website from an agency perspective will be kind of jumping from one client to, to the other. So you don't get their full 100% devotion and attention. They have multiple clients that they're working off. You're just one of many. Whereas in an in-house team, you have that person focused primarily and exclusively on your website and your brand. That also leads into the product knowledge. An agency will know your product, but they might just know it based on what they see on Google and they might not be as detailed as they should be. Whereas someone working in-house will have communication and relationships with people in product development, people in different part of the organization, customer service. So they will have a better understanding of your products and services. And then you look at training and career progression with agencies they have to keep costs down so they have to hire people uh, fresh graduates from the entry level and train them as quick as possible there are pros and cons to that because someone with an agency background of one year will rise quickly they will be trained very fast so they might not be as deep in terms of skill capability as you would expect because they have to move them higher quickly higher above the reason why i say this i've seen a head of seo in agencies that have like four or five years experience whereas you have a head of seo in-house that has 20 or 15 years experience it's not the same although the title is the same but the level of experience is not is not the same but one thing i would say with agency is their onboarding process is extremely good and that also leads into the training process whereas with in-house team it's not as good as, as you would expect. And then you look at stakeholder management as well. And that in in-house teams, you have access to important stakeholders like the IT team and different departments where, because you have that product knowledge. So the speed of execution of tasks, you're able to do that better in-house and you can start something from the scratch and then finish it. Whereas with agencies, you have situations where an agency will make recommendations to the client and that will sit within the IT team for months. The agency is still getting paid, but you're not getting the full, full benefit. So 
in my opinion, it's better to hire an in-house team as opposed to hire an agency. But if you don't have the access to the skill and capability that you need, you might go with an with, a, with an agency. And another thing that I've seen in, in the industry is in-house team coupled with marketing consultants. So if you get that that hybrid because a marketing consultant can also be part of your in-house team so that's another another option that you you can consider so it, it necessarily just depend on your on your sector and your skill of availability in terms of um access to different types of tools and capacity management and the way in which decisions are made is yeah. there a difference between the two yeah that's that's a good point so when it comes to decision making process you agencies don't have that authority they need to get signed up from the client whereas in-house team sometimes there's possibility of delegating authority to the marketing team and in terms of access to tools that is not necessarily an advantage with agencies because whatever tool that the agency is using you have better tools on the market open source tools that you can if you have the money for the subscription you can you can buy but agencies sometimes pitch and position themselves that they have a martech tool that they use that they develop most of most instances you can get those tools freely on the market um, semrush hf i'm not affiliated with those tools but you can get tools that would do more than whatever your agency is pitching to you so from a market perspective you don't have any benefits from an agency and in terms of uh, creativity and being entrepreneurial and bringing in fresh ideas, is it better to go with an agency or an in-house team? So that's a good question because there's this perception that agencies will bring their team together, they'll brainstorm and they'll bring ideas. But are they your target market? Are they your target audience? So that's a myth where you oh, will brainstorm and give you ideas. You want a marketing team, in-house or agency, that focuses on your customer, understands your customer because your customer is the target audience, not, not, not an agency. So in terms of creativity, I think it's a myth that an agency will bring creativity because you can get creativity by talking to your customer, understanding their pain point. That's how you get creativity and talking to the product team, in my opinion, yeah. Femi Olajiga, thanks. So before we conclude, if you have any if you need any help with digital marketing consulting or you need help with uh, in-housing your team, give me a shout. Thank you.